Hey folks, this is my brother laser printer and I had a viewer ask me if um, they could show them how to uh, reconnect with their uh, Wi-Fi network. Uh, this is a Wi-Fi printer uh, and they must got uh, an interruption and somehow the printer doesn't remember what network they're on. So I'm going to show you how to do that. So um, start by pressing the power button and uh, this, this screen. So I'm going to have to zoom in and out here because my camera doesn't like to focus on the screen so it says please wait and we'll wait while it's booting up you'll see that the Wi-Fi button over here is flashing because I am connected to my Wi-Fi network but I'm going to show you how to reset it so what we're going to do is okay so we're basically we're going to use a couple different buttons here there's this button here that says menu there's this button that says okay there's this down button or negative minus button and there's this plus button we're going to go up and down and stop and exit and those are the only buttons we're going to use but like I said, I may have to sh uh, zoom in to show you what the screen says just because of the resolution on this camera and how it reacts to light on that LCD screen. So, zoom out. We're going to go to uh, menu. So, when you press the menu button, the screen says select up or down. That will be these arrows here. Down, up, plus, up, negative, down. And then you have uh, uh, your your top menu. So go hit the down button. Go to copy, three printer, for network. Network is what we want. So now we hit the OK button over here. Okay. So now it says network one L A N. Scroll down. Two Wi-Fi Direct. Three network reset. So we're going to go to W L A N basically Wi-Fi local area network or wireless local area network so I'm going to hit OK okay alright now we have more options TCP IP no we're going to go down to setup wizard setup wizard hit OK now it's searching for our local area network so make sure that your net that your that your Wi-Fi is on Okay, make sure your router is on. That's how you're going to get the uh, you know information from anything that's on that Wi-Fi network that you want to print with to the printer. Okay, so it detected my local network. That's the name of my um, Wi-Fi network. So I'm going to hit OK. Now it's going to ask me for wait, hit OK. Now it's going to ask me for my network key. Network key is basically the password. Okay. So, obviously, I don't have a keyboard here to type in the passwords, and this is just blinking like blank. So, what does that mean? Well, if you let's see if I can do both at the same time, okay. So, if you hit the down button, it'll go through, and you can see it's changed to a symbol, a tilde, uh, close uh, bracket. Okay, if you go up, press the up key, you'll get numbers zero, one, two, three, four, and then eventually after 9 it will go to the lowercase a. Now remember this is case sensitive so lowercase letters are first so like the first one in mine is M you hit OK scrolls over one now your second alphanumeric code or symbol um, so if you press the up key and hold it it'll scroll through them progressively faster so say you want to go to a capital letter. Capital letters start after it goes through the alphabet. So lowercase z, and then it'll start with capital A. See what I'm saying here? Okay. Well, I don't have any in my any capital letters in mine. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, go through here and uh, hit my password. You can just tap this button really fast in order to scroll through them or like I said you can hold down and um, and it'll go through them as well and it starts over at the uh, top of the list so if you have a numeric password this is going to go much faster than it's going for me right now since I have to spell uh, phrase so just hang on here with me a second and this happens. I mean, this happens if there's like a power failure or. Um... Okay, so if you make, I made a mistake. So if you make a mistake, 
um, and you have to go back after you pressed OK, hit the clear button, it also has this little return arrow on it, and it'll go back one um, character. So that's good to know. Yeah, but if you have a power interruption or if you have to upgrade your, your uh, network, if you have to move your printer, like say you're going to like go over your uh, relative's house and help them print something, like this is uh, something you might have to. All right, so once you're done putting in your network key, hit OK. You might have to hit it twice. And then you'll get this uh, uh, prompt. It'll say apply settings, yes or no. So the up arrow for yes. And then it says collecting, connecting to wireless local area network, WLAN. And you can see it is because the Wi-Fi um, light is flashing. See this flashing here? Okay. So after a minute, it should say connected. And it does. Okay, connected. Press OK key. So press OK key. And uh, now we're back to the menu. So we're connected, and you can see we're connected because the Wi-Fi green light here is steady on. It's not searching. When it was searching, it was flashing, searching for the network. When it's steady on, you know you're connected to your Wi-Fi network. So that's a good way to know that you're ready to print. Okay, so so yeah, you're still at the, in this menu here. So how do you get out of that? Well, all you do is you press um, this red uh, button over here, stop, exit, and now you're back in your like standby mode. Okay, where it's ready to copy. It's actually said it's in sleep, sleep means standby. And then if you want to turn the power off, you just hold the power button until it says shutting down. And now you're done. So that's it. So I uh, hope this helped you. Uh, please like the video. That helps me. And uh, see if you can help somebody else today with uh, one of their issues. If you have any questions, go ahead and put them in the comments below. Thanks. Have a great day.